The Kenya Kwanza government believes in the rule of law and will, f and will fully implement all the nine points of women agenda as stipulated in the plan. I therefore call upon all players for increased concerted and global actions to end female genital mutilation. Increased funding for the Anti-Female Genital Mutilation Board and fully implement the anti-FGM laws. End of quote. To reinforce point four under the women agenda, His Excellency the President of on 5th December 2022, during the launch of the State of Judiciary Report in Nairobi, he said, and I quote, FGM should not be a conversation we are having in Kenya in the 21st century. We must go out of our way, and I assure you of my administration's support in ensuring that we eliminate FGM in our country because it is not only against the law, it is endangering the health of girls. We need to bring men and boys on board as change agents into constructive power with other community members to improve, to improve the conditions of women's lives. The 15% prevalence is still unacceptable. Our desire is to realize zero tolerance. That is why we are here today commemorating the International Day of Zero Tolerance for Women Genital Mutilation. Nataka ni seme, nataka ni rudi hapa, nikiwa na habari kamili kwamba migori hakuna tena ukeketaji sasa imeenda asilimia zero. Na nataka ni wape onyo. Onyo lililo kali na lisilo pendeza. Kwa mangariba wote. Wale kina mama wanao husika na kukeketa wasichana. Nataka ni wambie na ni wape onyo. Ole wenu. Ole wenu. Kitu ambacho ni chamuhimu sisi wetu tuzingatie. Ni kwamba serekali haina mchezo. Kauli mbiu ya rais wa jamuhuri ya Kenya ni kwamba lazima ukeketaji ukomeshwe. Kwa hivyo ukipatikana ole wako. Na tutaeka na tutahakikisha tuko na structure mpaka chini mashinani. Wale mangariba wote ufanye kazi usiku, ufanye kazi ndani ya shimo, ufanye kazi mchana, ufanye kazi ngambo tunakwambia mkono wa sheria utapatana na wewe. Thank <laughs> you.